Hey guys, just want to make a quick video today on a vehicle that we have in the shop that uh, uh, was a truck that I thought was the coolest thing when I was a kid. Let's go check it out. <laughs> Hey guys, so we've got a uh, 1979 Little Red Express here, Dodge uh, 150 they call them. Um, or so as you can see, this customer came in, we're just doing a safety on it, he's putting it on the road. And this thing is really, really clean. Um, not sure, maybe the guy's name was Rob or something, but he added that. But everything else I guess is all original. The paint, with the exception of the front fenders, I believe were repainted. Uh, he said the rest of it has not been touched. It's got 70,000 original kilometers. I don't know what that is in miles, but it's very low for a 1979. I guess a older gentleman, uh, well, there's a little bit of rot on the wood, but I mean, that's no big deal at all. This thing is very, very clean. Let's take a look around here. I guess a uh, older gentleman old, uh, owned this. Uh, since new 1979 he worked at Chrysler's and he had the engine uh, built at the plant that he worked at uh, here in Windsor and uh, he followed it down the line had the uh, you know engine when it was done I guess they get shipped to Livonia or something in Michigan and it gets put into the uh, into the uh, truck so he um, followed it all the way till it was done and he's owned it ever since and now this gentleman that brought it to us bought it from this guy who's now like 86 years old and uh he's putting it on the road which is really cool these are the 360s that came in these the police uh, versions of these engines um, they came with like 225 horsepower i believe from the factory and they had uh, hemi style mufflers and a crossover pipe or something that went to these stacks here uh, to give them a little more power and uh, it's a really really cool truck all leather interior or whatever this is if it's leather I'm not sure but really good shape I mean the dash no cracks remember these old radios <laughs> seat or a armrest if, if you need excellent excellent condition just such a cool truck. You don't see too many of these around anymore in this kind of condition. A little tear in the seat, but I mean, it's not torn. It's just the stitching is coming apart. But I mean, 1979, everything works. We've tried everything. Everything works. Somebody must have added a trailer or brake. Um, but uh, yeah, wow, this is, a, this is a good find for the guy. Excellent, excellent find. Well, there you go. Just thought I'd show you that. Just one of the things that uh, came in today. Thought it would be interesting. And a little something to add, this is a 79, so in 78 they had um, uh, one single headlight and in 79 they changed to the dual headlights. And something else I just read on it is that they went to, uh, they added catalytic converters on this, uh, on the 79s and you can see them right there. Um, whereas the 78s didn't have that. So just a little point of interest. Take it out of the shop here, see how it runs. Starts right up. Kind of love the buzzers from the 80s eh? or 70s. This one, yeah, all the gauges work. I won't turn on the radio, YouTube. Yeah, that that smooth feeling engine though it's uh although it's a police version it's uh, not a exactly a loud sounding engine by any means very cool I can feel the heat so I know that it works nice wiper switch there, squirters work 
This thing is in really good shape. Impressive. So again, guys, just thought I'd give you a quick look at this vehicle. Uh, I grew up uh, just thinking these were the coolest trucks because back then in the early 80s and that, um, I mean, 225 horsepower was actually pretty strong. I mean, today that's nothing, but they were just cool trucks all around. Uh, and they were only made for two years, 78 and 79, I believe. And there was 2,100 and, uh, and change made in 1978 and about 5,100 or so made in 79, uh, this one being a 79, you know, obviously there's more out there, but they're getting very rare. It's very rare to find them in this condition anyway. And, uh, you know, I, I tried, honestly, I tried to buy it from the guy and he wouldn't sell it to me. He, he wants to keep it. Uh, again, he just bought it and he, he thinks it's pretty cool as well and didn't want to sell it to me, but I tried anyway. So hope you enjoyed it guys. Please give me a thumbs up. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.